Welcome to slide 26, anaphase. The chromosomes in anaphase are being pulled apart. And when chromosomes separate during this particular phase, ana means pull away. And what you're seeing here is that when you zoom in really close on this cell, you'll see a V characteristic of each chromosome. The chromosomes were in an X, and now they're pulled from an X, which is double strand, away from each other in the single strand and spindle fibers are attached here and spindle fiber is here and it's pulling this one this direction it's pulling this single strand this direction this single strand now this direction and this direction away from each other pushing away these single strands of DNA are known as chromatids one way that I tell students to remember that is kids, like little kids, but don't put kids on the test, it's chromatids. So pulling apart and chromatids are your answers for this particular slide. The next phase is the finishing phase. Toast is what it stood for on our abbreviation. Telophase. Tello means final. In telophase you have two new cells forming. Check this out. This is cheek cells, y'all. These are regular sized cheek cells and look at these two new young ones. They're smaller, they're together. These are what is known as daughter cells. And basically once you have daughter cells, the nucleus will begin to reform. All the cell organelles will begin to go back to normal. The nucleolus will appear, nucleo, nucleoli will reappear, nuclear envelopes will reform and then cytokinesis will happen and this cytoplasm will pinch all the way through and make two completely new independent daughter cells. Here is a review of mitosis. Can you figure this out? We're going to give you a chance to take some time now and work with this slide. What's your best guess on the different phases for one, two, three, and four? We'll come back in just a little bit 